not every cradle cap is a seborrheic dermatitis. Um, this is um, either the pediatrician or um, the um, uh, 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 pediatric dermatologist should have a high suspicious, uh, a high index of suspicious about this condition. Um, so usually we see these children very rarely and we diagnose initially as seborrheic dermatitis. Uh, we give some topical steroid creams, antifungal and moisturizer cream, but it doesn't help. The baby comes again very quickly, very unwell uh, with failure to thrive and, and, and poor appetite. And, and this is, um, should be uh, uh, diagnosed very uh, quickly as it's literal seaweed disease, which as you know, carries about 40 to 50% of death rate with poor prognosis. They usually present in the first two years of life, involves many organs, but usually uh, the skin is the earliest involvement and um, um, that's why you need either to arrange a biopsy yourself or refer, refer to the pediatric dermatologist to um, start to arrange a biopsy or confirm the diagnosis. And you might need to involve, involve the hematologist and then oncologist to start the treatment. 